Uh. Oh, hi. You probably forgot what happened. Well, first of all, Freddie and Roxy broke up. Next, Freddie accused me of convincing him to break up with her because he thought I was still in love with her, which I am not. But then he vowed not to be my friend anymore, and then I got run over by a car. Well, I'm, I'm still really sorry about that car thing, man, Ted. I don't think you are. But look, it's not that big a deal, is it? You broke my legs. I am immobile for the next couple of weeks. Look, man, if it was me, if that was me, I would have been thrilled. I wouldn't have to move or anything. Why would you even run me over with a car anyway? There was a safety video. A safety video for what? Well, to teach kids what, what the pain is like of being run over by a car. First of all, kids don't drive. And second of all, that you could have used a dummy. Yeah, but, uh, well, a real person is, is more simulated to pain. And that is why I wanted to emphasize the pain. I hate you so much, Sonic. Love you too, Ted. Ugh. Don't worry. We'll help you out any way we can. Actually, I'm not in the mood for helping you out, so I can't. Okay, I'll help out any way I can. Anyways, I'm, I'm just gonna leave. I have absolutely no idea why I'm here anyway. Look, Chica, are you just gonna leave? Nay, abandon the a disabled youth such as myself, whose life hangs from a thread, where his only chance of survival is the love and affection of his true friends. Oh, well... Yep, bye! D -d -d chica, Chica, come back here, you pompous piece of poultry! And she's gone. Don't worry, I'll just I'll just go get you a drink. No, don't, don't, you don't need to go get me a drink. And he's gone too. Don't worry. I'll, I'll stay here and cover you. Are you sure? I mean, after that whole sleeping pill fiasco? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Never mind, I can't help you. No, no, come back here. And he's gone too. Great. My legs are broken. I lost one of my friends. My other friends have abandoned me. And now I need to take a dump. This is literally the worst moment of my entire life. Well, since no one's here, might as well, you know. Ow! Mm. I guess he broke that too. This is officially the worst moment of my entire life. <laughs> I just think you should apologise to Will. But it's not my fault he got run over by that car. You know what I mean. No, I, I still can't forgive him. But it wasn't his fault, alright? You just didn't love Roxy as much as you thought you did. That's all there was to it. He helped you see the truth. Look, if, if Will convinced you to break up with Bonnie... Wouldn't you be mad at him? Well, well that's, that's, that's not very valid, because he's not in love with either of us. He's not in love with Roxy, either. Well, that's not the point. <sighs> Your anger's with you. Don't take it out on Will. What's, what's your, I don't know what you're talking about. I think you do. What you guys talking about? We're talking about how much we hate Will. Ew, can I join in? Ugh. I'm go- I have to go. He's such a meanie, isn't he? Oh, such a meanie. 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 What else you got? Well, I just don't want to be stuck in this bed for two weeks. I want a second opinion. Well, don't worry. I've got a few doctors you might be able to talk to. What, really? Yeah, I'll go get them. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, this is going to be a bit mistake, isn't it? Oh, well. Uh, I got you your water. Oh, thanks, Goldie. You're a peach. Um, doesn't seem to be a lot of water in here. 
Yeah, well, well, it was a long trip, and it was very heavy, and I'm, I'm very small and weak, so in the long run. Oh, well, that that's great. Thanks. Thanks, anyway. <laughs> oh, I'm going to go get you some cookies now. Just as long as you don't eat them all on the way. Never mind. Hmm, what seems to be your ailment, youngster? Well, my legs are broken, and the doctor said I had to stay in bed for a couple of weeks. Deal with it. No, come back. Oh, he was owed no help. Oh, don't, don't, don't worry. Dr. Patrick's in the house. I am dead. Well, let me just get my trusty tools out. Ah. Wait, what are you going to do with that hammer? Don't worry. We're just going to bash your legs in so that then they'll be good as new. No, don't whack my legs with a hammer. You're, you're right. They might be infected. Your only chance of survival now is to cut them off. Cut them off? Oh, no. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. Oh, no. I can't move. Get me out of here. <laughs> Dr. Sonic here with a top health tip. I'm gonna kill, Toad. If you're involved in an accident which results in injury, the best way to deal with that injury is to perform the same accident once more. Are you saying you want to run me over again? It's your only chance of survival, Ted. Don't call me Ted. <laughs> Yes, hello, is this the pizza place? Yeah, I understand that you put mushrooms on your pizza, but uh, I was wondering if you, uh, if we could also supply you with the mushrooms to go on the pizza, because there's this really annoying one that I want to get rid of, but... Hello? Hello? Ugh. I'm starting to think the whole world is against me right now. <sighs> Hi, Freddy. I'm not apologizing to Will. Bye, Freddy. Hey, Freddy! Bonnie! How are you, my best friend? Ah, good. Listen, I need to do you a favour for me. Well, sure, anything for you, pal. Oh, good, because uh, I kind of need you to draw apologise to Will. S SpongeBob! How are you, my best friend? Really? Really? I'm your best friend? Oh, th ah, this is the best day of my life! Yahoo! How'd it go, Bonnie? Well, uh, SpongeBob's Freddy's uh, new best friend now, so uh, not very good. Oh, great. I've got one last hour in my quiver. It's a long shot, but it's all I've got. Could you go get me on my phone? What? Why? Just go get me on my phone! Okay, fine, I'll get it. <sighs> hey, Will. Oh, hi, Ash. You poor baby. Stuck in bed all day. Are you patronizing me? No, I'm not patronizing you, you you big baby who can't get out of bed anymore because you broke his legs. Yes, you are patronizing me. Just, I don't appreciate it. Well, it doesn't matter because you broke your legs. You can't get out of bed. <laughs> ooh, ooh, mm, that girl already gets my tantrum going. Mm, Bonnie, where's my phone at? Mm, it's hot. It's hard for me to have a tantrum when my legs are broken. Hmm. Okay, I think it goes without saying that we make great doctors. Yep, we're the best. Oh, do we should have our own doctor show. You know, if I was ever in an a and &E situation, I'd want you guys by my side. Mainly because I don't ever need an a and &E situation because I'm immortal. So, what hospital show are you thinking? Like, Doctor Who? <laughs> that sounds like an amazing show. I just, I'm just not sure if the studio would go for it, though. Yeah, I don't, I'm not too bothered about a and &E. I mean, I mean, those people, like, mo moaning and wailing and ask, begging for help. Well, I'm sorry, Squidward, but the vending machine wouldn't take my money. Oh. 
Hey guys, where have you been? We've just been uh, treating uh, patient Will. Oh yes, he's so pathetic. Why are you obsessing over Will anyway? Well, because he's in, in that situation and it's funny. I think I know the real reason why you're picking on him a lot. Do you? Yep. You're in love with him. What? No, I'm not. That makes perfect sense. Oh, yes. What are we talking about? What? No, it doesn't make sense. I don't love him. Denial is like the most common uh, sign that you love someone. What, you mean like just straight out saying you love someone isn't as effective? Precisely. That, that, that's just ridiculous. No, actually, I have to, I have to side with him. I mean, when a girl says, drop dead, you suck, stuff like that, it just means she wants me even more than someone who asks me that they want to bet me tonight. I pity the female gender. Oh, the great Mr. T impression. What? No, no, that was not Mr. T. But how do you even know who Mr. T is? But, but we're getting away from the point. What point? The point that Ashley is in love with Will. What? No, I am not in love with Will. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. It's, no, I'm not. Stop it! She's in love with him. Do, do, we, do you even want to know what Mr. T sounds like? No, I, I should tell him what Mr. T sounds like. I, I do a much better Mr. T impression than you do. Actually, I think I should do it. Why? Do you think you do a better Mr. T impression than me? I think I do a better everything than you. Oh yeah, prove it! Good! Come on, man! Come on, man! Come on, man! Come on, man! Oh, my glasses! Oh, this is great! I'm gonna go get some popcorn! Come on, man! 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 Will called me. Oh. The, whatever he said. The, it's not about what he said. It's about what you said. But that, that wasn't fair, Freddy. Will didn't do anything wrong, and you know it. You're right. I guess I was just mad at myself, and I... I just... Felt, felt like taking it out on someone. You shouldn't have done that. You're right. I'll, I'll go talk to him. Try and make things right. Good. Hey, listen. Do you, do you possibly... Uh, do you think you could take me back, possibly? I don't know, Freddy. I love you, but I meant what I said. I I just need some time to think about what I really want. And so do you. You're right. I'm sorry. Me too. Hey, Will. You mean it? Yeah. I want to apologize for the way I acted. No, I, I guess it was just easier for me to get mad, on my, mad at you than at myself. There's no excuse for that. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's okay. Thanks for apologizing. So, can we be friends again? We never stopped. Really? Really? Oh, thanks, Will. You're, you're a nice guy. Well, I'm very forgiving. Yeah, I hear that. Your feet smell very cheesy. Shut up and just rub. Oh. Of course, sometimes it could be a bit harder at times. Well, uh... Well, just so you know, 
uh, me and Roxy aren't getting back together. It's... Uh, that's fine. I mean, you you two will probably work it out. Well, if it, if it was meant to be, it'll be. I mean, if I'm meant to spend my life with someone else, then I will. Same goes for her. I mean, whatever whatever happens will happen. Mm, of course, yeah. But, uh, yeah, hang in there, though. Well, thanks. I'll see you later. Alright, bye, Freddy. Huh. What a great day. Hey, well. Hi, Chica. I just, uh, want to apologize for the way I acted to you. Why is everybody all of a sudden apologizing to me? Oh, well... I just wanted to apologize for the way I acted earlier. I mean, I think I'm, I've been getting quite hormonal lately. Um, well, I've I've also been getting strange cravings on an unrelated topic. I've also been throwing up a little bit, and I think I'm putting on a bit of weight. I mean, I'm I'm getting rounder. Um, Chica, uh, hold on one second, I gotta go. But Chica, I think you might be pregnant. Eh, maybe, maybe not. You know, it's... You just take me back again I always wanted to be more than friends